Hello, dog army. This is my house. Careful not to scare the horse, because I don't want to die. That's how we get to school in Denmark. Reminds me of Oblivion. Yeah, I guess it's kind of like Oblivion. You hear the cows? Ooh. Wow, look, you guys. It's real cakes. Wow. Look, guys, there's an old watch. Sorry, guys, I'm trying to be respectful. I don't want to be rude. I'm running around here in a prehistoric place with a camera. Man, you can't not buy a cake after that. I'll buy a cake later. This is like Skyrim. I miss this. This is, after all, my hometown. If you buy that stream, doesn't it count as a business expense? I suppose it does, but I have to lean into my pocket, and I don't want to do that right now because I'm streaming. It steps aloud, yeah. It's because it's got horseshoes on. You can't believe this is a real place. You've seen this kind of place in so many video games. Didn't you think it was based on a real place? Oh, sorry, guys. I can film in here, but I'm not allowed to be a dog. Fuck it. We're gonna break the rules. So this would be where the Lord lived, but there's no Lord anymore, so... Was that the lady of the house? Cool. The windows here, the railings here. This is just how every Danish town looks like, guys. This is loud. That's the windmill stuff in here. Do not spit on the ground. Hey, that came out in 2014. That's weird. Percy J These are old movies, though. This is weird. <laughs> I think we're in 2014 or something. Guys, I think that lady is fake. I have a confession to make. We're in a museum town. This isn't what Denmark actually looks like. This is a museum town where you tap in time. This is where we started. Now we are here. This is in my town, okay? We trusted you. <laughs> I had to delete the clip. Oh, I'm sorry. If you were there, you were there. If you weren't, you weren't. This is my real city. This is where I used to go to school. And this used to be a film school. I made comedies because I knew they were going to be bad. Go right down here to like edit. I miss my film school days. I want to show you this place, which is like a hippie place. Oh, I love the street art here. Oh, that's really good. Ooh, writers unite. Hell yeah. I want to be part of this. No one invited me. Hey, Cassandra. Kaz? Kaz? I want to be paid more for writing my story. Our CEOs are allowed to join a union. <laughs> Imagine if I strike within my own studio that I own. I want to be paid more. I'm gonna punch you with my dog ball. I believe the story goes that the Danish government purchased these trains. They don't work, by the way, from an Italian company. And the Italian company were actually mafia related. And the trains were filled with drugs and shipped to Denmark. Illegal drug sale went up like 500%. It was huge news. This place is pretty cool. Look at this. It's like a little playground here. Humanity before profit. Hell yeah. There's a little house on top of here. Some political messaging here. They make killer burgers here. This is the old train station. These are train tracks. The train station isn't in use anymore, so they just let anyone build whatever they wanted. Atomic power. Yes, please. It's got like a little skateboarding area over here. I kind of almost want to skateboard, but I know it's going to go wrong. I think there should be like public property areas where people can just make their own little thing. Like if I just wanted to try making a burger joint, I should just be allowed to go somewhere and build a little burger joint. And I think that's pretty cool. Right side. Because over there, it's all capitalism. But here, they can just make some burgers. Oh God, that's loud. I'm sorry guys, don't know what's going on over there. That's where the hipsters make their unbelievable burgers or whatever. <laughs> that guy looked at me like I was insane. So actually the hipster place used to be here, but they removed it. You see all that? That was all used to be hipster stuff. I think we're gonna go to the Gamer Cave. I can't wait to show you guys our comic shop. I think it's the oldest one in all of Denmark. Potentially the oldest comic shop in the world, I've heard. It's called Striebelel. But I want to show you guys where I play Yu-Gi-Oh! locally sometimes. This is the music school. You guys ready to see the Gamer Cave? Did you guys just say boy smell sniffer? <laughs> What's the place called? It's called Epic Panda. Here is the church. I've been to Tokyo. <laughs> We're talking about Tokyo chat. He's trying to pick up a Japanese girl. I interrupted his wrist. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the church. Okay, it's very important that we be quiet and respectful. Dear Father, Lord in heaven, forgive me for my sins of lusting after big, sexy, hunky men. I'm sorry for lusting after every single member of Invicta. I'm sorry for liking big, sexy men. I am so sorry. Woof. Amen. This is a historical Danish warship. Look, it's like night signs, night sigils and stuff. It's Jesus. Jesus had good Wi-Fi. Can you ask if the Lord forgives Lute Fanart? I can try that.
our Lord Father in heaven, but my Lady Merpini, she begs you of forgiveness for drawing Lude Van Art. Please forgive her, my Lord. Amen. I'm gonna run out before I incur God's wrath. He's cruel with the Lude Van Art, I'm sure. Oh my God. To say hi to a fellow dog. We're gonna meet Sif. Where is Sif? She said she was watching me. That's terrifying. So I was at the wrong crossing. Wait, did you think someone else was me? Is there another streamer? I just thought you were at the work location. At work, the location. Oh, there you are. Hello. Uh, why are you bring a body pillow? <laughs> oh my god. It's it's for real, for real. She's here. It's Sif. I like your body pillow. So what is this place? This is probably the new week central. Calvin and Hobbes, uh, or as they say in Danish, Stein and Stoffel. Actually, that other thing about it, that sounds like kind of funny. Yeah, it is like a stoner fun. and a drugs. You like these stars, right? I love these stars. And I love that character specifically. Look, it's Bao's favorite animal. It's about a girl who dates a wolf. Okay, so we were asked to go see the Yaoi section. That's fine. I've showed Carl on screen before. Boy meets Maria. That's not a Yaoi. Oh no, Maria's a boy. Grandma's of demonic cultivation. Can you open it? Is that like my Chinese baby YouTubers? Yes. What is this? Lesbian brothers. <laughs> Cherry magic. It's a very popular one, if you see it. You can't see the Yaoi, it's pixelated. Oh no. What are these two remind you? That's the guy from Hollow Tempest and then Noir. Oh, there's a There's woman a in it. it. She, she better be the villain. Oh, hey, Ben. You know Ben? Ben, ben D's nuts. <laughs> no, it's I Ben Arms. Like it's an actual person. Doesn't even work. What does Ben D's nuts even mean? No, Doesn't even work. Bend over. Oh, I could. Yeah, Sif's got more wrist than me. Oh, God, guys, it's a real gun. Shut the fuck up, Sif. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> World of Warcraft board game. Hey, yo. <laughs> no, it's not real guns, guys. It's just airsoft. <laughs> a massive truck over there just like overpowered you. Someone said isekai moment, what happened? Me and Sif have both had like a few racist people be mean to us. There was like one lady who was mean. She was a runner, she was like running past me. She yelled the Turk equivalent of the n-word at me. And I don't think she expected me to run after her. <laughs> just to give her a little fright, I didn't do anything. Cause I'm a dog. <laughs> Catch these paws! <laughs> no, I didn't do that. Oh, my favorite shot here. Hold on guys. Oh, nice to get some water. Stop showing us trash. What if I want to show you trash, huh? I have to put you off. How you did that? Our first stream people. Some guys came by and said, fuck my father. Is that your mom? Wow. It was a bit pixelated. That person actually looked like someone I know. Hero, go beat them up for me. Go, Hero, go. <laughs> Say, bro, this you? <laughs> Do it. There we go. 7-Eleven Denmark. Just water. The 7-Eleven here is so sad. Where's the Slurpee? Is there Slurpee in 7-Eleven here? No, there's not, right? No, no Slurpees in 7-Eleven, guys. Ooh, Toy Store! Can we die? Oh, God. This is very Five Nights at Freddy's vibe. Hey, yo! Fall Guys. Among Us. Sus. Sus. Fortnite! Kill the other kids, still you're the only one left. We're gonna check out Cake Store real quick. Strawberry Cake. Comic Store. I'm gonna go inside now. He has given us permission to film. Oh, that's an old one. It's the other comics here. Hmm. Kitra says she would spend all her money in this store. Only well, most of it is in Danish. I think there's some English stuff. This is One Piece in Danish. It was published by Carlsen Manga. I called them once and asked if they wanted to publish my comics. This was before I was posting them on the internet. They told me, oh, manga's a dead market. Was there a contest or something to make superheroes? So here's Super Soy Boy. Eat your veggs. Superpower is making people guilty about their diet. Perfect skin and digestion. And he's a fair fighter. That's Digitalia. And here's my favorite, you guys. Them. It's a girl. No, it's a man. It's them. <laughs> <laughs> and then Neon Pig. I like this comic store. Oh, Sandman. And Neil Gaiman stuff. From Neil. Wait a moment. Free comics? Is that for real, for real, no cap? Shaman King. Flowers. But this is purely a hypothetical. If there's a Danish person who might be a comic writer, if he brings comics to you, will you sell them in the store? I can't. I'm sold. <laughs> Fair enough. Have a good day. Okay, you too. That wasn't a no. That wasn't a no. That was a, uh, can't promise they'll get sold, but I'll do it. I like that guy. Yeah, Danish people speak perfect English. Perfect. 